Okay, hi, I'm going to show you how to do a wave underline effect. So here I have an example of a navigation page about work, contact, which would be links. They would be relative links along your website. So instead of just going to a page, just a slight animation. So let's look at the HTML page, the index page. Here we are. Body, background light blue. Down here, body. What we have, list. List items about work and contact. With an anchor, href, you can put in. UL is unordered, so. UL unordered list class waves. That's attached to this here, but more CSS in the style sheet. So here is just some inline CSS now. UL dot waves, list style type none. Default, lists always have a default one, two, three, etc. Unordered lists have some a default of a bullet point. I don't want anything on it. List style type none. I have to put that in. Margin zero, pattern zero, text line center. And font size for this is 84 pixels. Default color for links is blue. So I've had to put a different color in. I didn't have to, but I chose a different one. Anchor color black. For this, for this example, I put text as black. Okay, now I'm going to click on the star sheet. CSS star sheet. Okay, dot waves anchor. So the text display inline block. It's a block element position relative margin top. That's for the animation below the text. That's what that's going to be. That's what that's going to be there. Waves at hover and before position absolute display block is going to be the block element width of 100% height 20 pixels bottom minus 5. Okay, so it happens when you're hovering the, cu the cursor over the text. Okay, here we have background. For the line, basically, background, radial gradient, 16 pixels, transparent, etc. Animation, move one second, infinite linear. linear. So it happens for a second, then it continues if you're still hovering over. Then the animation here, height, 20 pixels, bottom, left, background position, animation. Those are all the gradients there. Here we have the keyframes at the bottom for the movement. Keyframes, move and movement two. So they refer, so they refer to those two different movements there. Animation move one, animation move two. Okay, let's go back to the template page. Let's have a look at it again. There we are, navigation page. Background light blue, text in black. Now as I hover over, those keyframes are kicking in. So everything's centered. That has a 100% width underneath, it has a margin. It's moving linear on a line, yeah? It's moving every one second. One, one, same, same. As I move away, nothing. Okay. 
there's the HG mount. Let's have a look at the style sheet. Okay, <clears throat> there's all the CSS. Content, etc. Background, it's all radial gradient movement. So either take the code there or you can download it at full themes.